Hello, my beautiful doves. Welcome back to Mama Appetite's Kitchen. So I've been gone for a little bit, so I am back. And I'm back with a really yummy, delicious... Oh my God, you guys are going to love it. It's a seafood gordita una gordita de mariscos you can use it as an appetizer you can use it as a full meal you know with rice and beans or just white rice even um, cilantro rice and it'll go perfect so enough talking and let's get started so here I have three cups of Maseca. This is the brand that I use. And to my Maseca, I'm gonna add a teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of salt. And I'm starting off with two cups of lukewarm water. Not hot, not cold, just in the middle. I'm gonna mix this really good. Hope you all are doing good. I want my masa to be a little bit more softer than uh, rather than to make like tortillas. So we'll probably need a little bit more than two cups of water. You know, Maseca is really, really dry corn flour. So I'm adding, I think maybe another cup of water, that's half a cup. Exactly three cups of water. See how it's a little bit softer than to make tortillas? Okay. Now, to my masa, I'm going to add a cup and a half of green onions, a cup of scallops. You can, uh, buy them whole and just cut them up in little pieces like I did. Two cups of shrimp. You could either buy it uh, de shell and de vein. I bought it uh, with the shell and uh, the little thing, in, that little thing you take out, the vein. I did everything myself. A cup of uh, imitation crab. Cup of mozzarella cheese. And let's use our best tools to mix it all in.
see how I'm doing I'm not smooching I'm just uh, try to get it incorporated okay guys we're gonna let this sit for about 15 mi minutes meanwhile I'm going to make the sauce that goes with the gorditas okay guys I'm gonna start on <clears throat> excuse me on my uh, sauce I'm going to be adding three large jalapenos cut up Ooh, they smell spicy I'm going to be adding a cup of cacique crema this is like half and half or heavy cream. Put a little bit of water. I'm going to add a little round thing of queso fresco. I'll show you which one it is. It's like this. Comes in a little round thing. You put the whole thing in there. And I'm adding half of an eight ounce of cream cheese. I'm gonna add my sauce to a low heat saucepan. I didn't add salt because the cheeses already have plenty of salt, but we'll see later on. And I'm adding like one third cup of cheese, just a little bit, the mozzarella cheese. And I'm gonna let it simmer here on low. Okay, my dove so now I'm going to my next step while my um, sauce is cooking I'm gonna make some agua de melon y mango this is a uh, fresh water uh, with fresh fruit so let's do this mango My mango is pitted. Going to cut it in pieces. We use the uh, skin and everything to make this water, agua fresca. Use that half. So I'm going to put it here on my bullet. This agua fresca, guys, is so refreshing. So now let's do my melon. God, it smells so yummy, so fresh. Now, what I do is I put seeds and all in the uh, bullet or the blender because we're still going to uh, strain it. A 
little bit of water. some stevia because I don't use regular sugar. So there you have it, doves. I'll be tasting it in a minute. So guys, I think my oil is ready for my seafood gorditas, gorditas de marisco. So I'm going to start to make my little balls. Your pan should not, your oil should not be really hot it should be just like in a medium Making a gordita is very easy. Just kind of roll it and pat on it. So you have it the right, the size you want it. Guys, these are similar to crab cakes, except these are made with maseca. Mm-mm-mm. So my job, these are ready to come out. Took about five to six minutes on to each, not each side, but right, to cook on both sides. 
Mmm, smells divine in here. So I'm gonna put them on paper towels for the excess oil. Oh, these are a little a little bit bigger than the ones I just made just to show you you can make them a little bit bigger have to be careful because that oil, oil always uh, splatters. Mm. And this big ones are done. So there you have it guys, my marisco gorditas, and this is seafood gorditas. So my jalapeno sauce is hot, so I'm just putting in some mozzarella. Father, in the name of Jesus, I thank you so much for this food, and I thank you so much for this blessed day. Amen. Okay, so let's try now guys. Oh my God, this jalapeno sauce. Mm -mm -mm. You guys, the seafood in this gordita is so scrumptious. melon and mango agua fresca so yummy you guys you have to make this recipe it will blow your head off now thank you so much for watching well let's hope it doesn't blow their head <laughs> <laughs> it'll blow your brains out <laughs> it'll blow your mind so thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on my next video. W.